This year has seen Camilla become a more prominent member of the royal family. As the Queen has taken a step back, Prince Charles and Camilla have given a glimpse into what the future of the monarchy will look like. And the monarch appears to be making decisions in order to ensure a smooth transition, one of the most notable being announced during her accession day message, which stated, It is my sincere wish that, when that time comes, Charles ascends the throne. Camilla will be known as Queen Consort as she continues her own loyal service. The monarch's announcement put to bed years of speculation over whether or not Camilla would ever be queen. However, while the sovereign has expressed her support for the Duchess, one royal commentator has claimed Camilla may not have won over the public in the same way. Appearing on Good Morning Britain GMB host Susanna Reid she argued, the queen has sort of anointed her future queen consort, adding, most people have forgotten about the breakdown of the marriage and they love her now. However, Mr Royston disagreed, citing recent poll data which suggests a large percentage of Brits still have mixed feelings towards Camilla, particularly with Diana's legacy of kindness and perception as a victim placing younger people on her side. He said, I don't think they have moved on, to be completely honest with you. You can see that in the polling that YouGov does, for example. People in the 1990s took Diana's side in this dispute and actually the younger generations growing up now feel just as strongly I think as people did back then. Mr Royston added, they love Diana. They love the legacy that she left, her humanitarian streak, her warmth and kindness and they feel she was the victim of an injustice basically. That she was, to use Diana's own words, a lamb to the slaughter when she married Charles. He concluded that Charles marrying Diana, introducing her to the demands of royal life at the young age of 20 and later having an affair with Camilla is what people today continue to raise a problem with. He said, it is that feeling that drives some of the negative sentiment towards Charles and Camilla. Oh, <laughs> 